back. Our bills. Bring back. Our bills. All right, my name is Yemi, and uh, today I'm speaking to you from a father's view, or one of the father of the kidnapped girl. His name is. All right, my bad. I'm speaking to you today from the eyes of the father of one of the kidnapped girls. His name is Yaku Kabo. So this dude asked the soldiers who was protecting the school children. And this is what he had to say. They told us that they had a gun battle with the Boko Haram attackers, but they ran out of ammunition. They were overpowered by them. There were 100 of them who were using superior firepower and rocket propelled grenades, Kabu said. The men had thrown their rifles into the bush and joined the fleeing crowd. There was no one to chase the militants as they herded the girls into the forest. This is what is happening. This is what happened like four weeks ago. Uh, gonna give me a minute to speak real quick. I actually just want to speak to our, Brex, uh, our president, the good luck Jonathan, and the government of Nigeria and our embassy back here. There is a story, there is another dimension to what is going on because some people are saying perhaps there is no kidnapping. And there are some people out there that are saying that there are northern forces basically frustrating the effort of our military men in Nigeria. But this is what I said, because the president actually thought that we are against him. We are not against you. Jonathan, we are not against you. We are your people, we are Nigerians. The reason why every one of us is here today is because you are not doing enough. That's right. What would you do if your child was kidnapped over two or three weeks ago? Will you be forming a committee? Will you be going on a campaign? Yes, say it. Will you be going around dancing? That's right, say it. We are not against you. You are the president. We are with you. We want you to be with us. You are not with us right now yes. because you are doing everything possible in your power to alienate us. Yes. You are alienating the parents of these girls yes. when you tell them that they are not cooperating with the military people. Hey. This is our. This is not how you govern your country. Right. No, no, not at all. The primary reason for a government is security. Yes. Right. If I cannot have security, why are you my government? Right. Why am I paying you taxes? Yes. Why am I calling you my president? Why? My president, why? excuse me. But you see, so really, this is your opportunity, President uh, Jonathan, Sorry. to please show compassion, show empathy, Show leadership. Show testicular fortitude. That's if I can right. say that. That's right. Show leadership to your people. Tell us that you are with us and we are with you, and you can take this war to the Boko Haram fellas. Yes. Thank you guys. Thank you all for being here.